This is our second video showcasing our new password protect feature. So let's get started. So we're just going to log into the editor. Just hover over the settings icon and to protect the page, just choose protect page. So you can click to enable protection for this page and choose whether you want to password protect it, so just create a password for the page, or you can require site member login so all members who have a username and unique password can also see the page. So I'm going to choose password protect and for my password I'll just put in cookie for example. So password protecting your page can be really helpful, especially if you have a small business and you want to create a page that has some wholesaler information, so it has some special prices for bulk orders. So for example, if I wanted to click on the wholesaler information on this Auntie's Cupcakes website, it would be password protected, so only people with the password would be able to enter it. So I can see all this information here now. So if you're a photographer, you could also use this password protect tool to show your clients some pre a preview of all the photos that you've taken of them that are untouched, so they can choose the ones that they like the best to have edited. So here, you can just enter the password for this page, and then they can choose the shots that they want. So if you were a wedding planner, you could also password protect a page to allow exclusive access just to your clients so they can approve the content. So for example, as a wedding planner, if you created this calendar, you could have the bridegroom and the bride have exclusive access to it so they can approve the content. And then, after that, you could also make this calendar a members only page. So just by hovering over the settings icon, you can choose to do that. So you click protect page, and now you can require site member login. And you can choose here if you want to add a member or manage your members now. And that will take you to the members tab at the top of the page. So I'll just click that here and I'll click yes. So now as the wedding planner, you could get the guest list from the bride and groom and invite members on their behalf. So to invite members, you can click to invite member and you can enter an email address. So for example, if I wanted to invite Auntie's Cupcakes, and click OK. So now an email will be sent to auntiescupcakesonline at gmail.com. So let's take a look at what the invitation looks like. So I can log in to the Gmail account. And they'll see this email here. And for them to accept the invitation, they can just click on this link. And now they can choose their own password. and they can submit that. And now they're officially a member and they can have access to that page. So I've already created a members only zone right here for Auntie's Cupcakes Online. So you can look at that. So I've provided exclusive coupon codes, some exclusive media for them to see. For example, you can click on this and only members can log in and look at the media. and they can play these videos. And by providing exclusive access to special deals and content, you can create a loyal fan base for your company. So one more thing before we go, I'm just gonna show you how you can take the protection off a page. You can turn off the page protection feature by hovering over the settings icon, clicking the pa protect page button, and you can uncheck this box. And once you click OK, your page won't require a password to be accessed. So that's it for this video, and I hope it was helpful. If you have any more questions or comments, you can always contact us at website.com through live chat, through telephoning us, and through submitting a ticket. See you soon.